How to play the game of snooker optimally? A presentation of www.gameroomaccessories.net To play snooker correctly and to have a chance against the strong competition, a player needs the right cue, playing techniques, physical and mental conditions. All these four components build an ultra-powerful weapon to beat the game. This review focuses on what a person needs to play snooker and also on what other requirements have to be met in order to become a super strong player. Only by showing different aspects of the game, giving you a better understanding of techniques such as potting, spin, bridges, you will be capable to improve in both skill and strategy. Learning positioning play is not a one-timer nor is it possible to acquire all fine approaches in one single day. It is the outcome of previous preciseness, practicing to sustain correct angel with the cue ball and knowing how to put an opponent under pressure. A serious player needs a wooden snooker cue, which is thick on one end and thin on the other end. When it comes to choosing a cue, there are a few wooden types and brands available. There are different balances, kinds of boards, different variations of cues, different size tips, one piece, two pieces, two pieces further down the queue, and many other variables. The best way to go about a snooker queue is by visiting a shop, testing various references and figuring out which one suits your hand best. The reason why you want to do this is because you want to find something that is literally made for you. We all have unique desires, wishes, styles and also hands. You want to look for your cue that it won't get damaged and also keep an eye on where you put it. The most important part of snooker cue is the tip, especially when it comes to playing solid games with serious and professional competitors. A person also needs a chart and has to brush the cue after each ball contact. This is mostly seen, come on, and the case for championships and tournaments. Professionals made this tiny task to a habit, and after each red ball or color, they brush the tip with the chalk carefully. Basic play techniques are impressing aspects before you actually touch the very first ball, like how to stand, how to hold the cue, and how to make a bridge. Regardless of whether you are a professional or amateur player, these basic techniques are essential to make each game better and drastically reduce weak performances. Focus on standing right and correct to the cue ball. Check the angel to the next ball that you are going to play and your snooker game is going to become better and better every day. These are some standards and elementary tips on how to start with snooker and should help to get a better feeling during a game. For more information on snooker please visit www.gameroomaccessories.net